And like all good photographers, she knows that any picture assignment begins with a thorough inspection of her equipment. All set and ready to go. photography, the helicopter is being used more and more. Its excellent maneuverability and hovering qualities make it ideal for this kind of work. Pat meets her pilot, one of the many flying officers in the Army today. An open cockpit like this makes a safety belt a must. But that same openness makes it a photographer's dream. You can shoot from any direction without obstruction. Again, Pat checks her equipment, just to make sure everything's okay. This is the sort of experience it's not so easy to get in civilian life. Even though a copter can hover indefinitely, Pat gets ready and lines up her shot ahead of time. One nice thing about this sort of photography, you can get any angle on the subject you want. A little higher, a little lower, it's all very easy in a helicopter. How about over that way, just a little? Swell. gets her picture. Her assignment completed, Pat can relax on the way home and enjoy the unique experience of a helicopter ride. Thanks, and a salute for her officer pilot, Pat returns to the pictorial center. A few minutes in the developer tells the story. Pat gets her excellent results because she's not only an experienced camera woman, but a trained technician as well. With three prints for good measure, Pat sees her assignment sheet. Between them, they select one for reproduction in the Army publication that first requested the coverage. Good food, good laughter, good cheer ever after. It's an old world saying that applies just as well in this modern Army mess hall. Pat has a date tonight, but with dinner over, she still has time to visit the PX and indulge in a woman's prerogative to search and search until she finds just the right lipstick to go with the dress she'll be wearing that evening. And this is Pat's date, who is waiting, as most dates do. Having bought the lipstick to go with the dress, Pat now searches again to find the right dress to go with the lipstick. And all the while her date waits and wonders what makes women the way they are. And just when he's most exasperated, Pat appears and all is forgiven. Soon, they'll both be off for an evening of fun and entertainment. But all too soon again, it'll be 6 a.m., and Pat will begin another day in the wax, the Women's Army Corps.
Whether it's sticking a photograph for an army publication or performing any of their other numerous functions, the wax around the world are an invaluable asset to your army and its mission of peace through strength. This is Sergeant Stuart Queen inviting you to be with us again next week for another look at The Big Picture. The Big Picture is a weekly television report to the nation on the activities of the Army at home and overseas. Produced by the Signal Corps Pictorial Center. Presented by the United States Army in cooperation with this station. You too can be an important part of the big picture. You can proudly serve with the best equipped, the best trained, the best fighting team in the world today, the United States Army.